Hey everyone, we are Aaron and Ben Napier and we're on the set of our new holiday film, A Christmas Open House, coming soon to Discovery Plus. We are here in Atlanta, Georgia, and we are shooting a Christmas open house. I play Melissa, and Melissa grew up in Rutledge, Georgia. She moved to Atlanta to make a name for herself. And she comes home and her mother has decided to sell her childhood home. And so it's very important for her to be able to be a part of selling the house. And along the way, she runs into somebody that she had a crush on in high school, and they reconnect and fall in love over the holidays. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thanks. <laughs> I'll be okay. Thank okay. you. <laughs> I think it touches on a lot of universal themes, even though it's a Christmas movie, you know? It touches on giving. It touches on so many things that I think during that time of the year, people are in a, a lot better spirit, and, I'm, and I think that's why people love the film. Ooh, those are corner biscuits. Everybody should get a biscuit. They're the best in town. <laughs> I feel like the thing people are going to take away from this movie is that you don't have to leave your hometown to live the life you want or to follow your dreams. I mean, the, the two main characters, David and Melissa, David has left his small town and gone to Atlanta, and then he's come back, and then Melissa is also trying to find her dream life. Melissa learns that it is okay to put your career first and to have a passion, but to always remember where you came from and to put family first, to put your personal life also at the forefront. Um, I think that's very important in giving herself over to the idea of falling in love and making that also a priority. It's got a lot of different emotional elements to it, so you're gonna be laughing at parts and you might tear up at other parts, and then obviously it's gonna end with you know this heartwarming, sort of happy ending that we all sort of attribute to these holiday films. There's a scene in the movie where Aaron and I are singing, and Aaron is an extremely talented singer. She has a beautiful voice, and I think that I think that fans are going to like that. And but Helen said you have a cute voice. Yeah, Helen Our says that, Mommy, you sing beautifully. Daddy, you sing cute. It's, uh, I think there's a compliment in there somewhere. Just think about those Victoria's Secret models that have to wear their bikinis in the winter. I'd love to wear a bikini in the winter. I bet you would. What happens when you are shooting a winter movie is often you have to shoot it in the summer. And we're wearing winter clothes. There are cicadas <laughs> that are buzzing. It's as hot as it normally is for us. We just don't normally do this in a sweater. We're not supposed to look like it's hot. Check it out. It's not really easy to get in the Christmas spirit when you're wearing sweaters in 95 degrees, but we have made it work. Not sweating will be the biggest challenge of the day. Obviously the time of the season doesn't help, but what does help is that if you look around all the props, we have some fake trees, we got some wreaths all in a box. Definitely feels like we're in the Christmas spirit. I reached the point where it, what you can, cause this was zip, so you can't tell that it's sweaty because it's all one color. That's the key. I would prefer to be in a sweater when it's cold out. I don't know if you can tell from the, the sweat on my face. <laughs> That's a camera wrap. I think we're just incredibly flattered that HGTV asked us to be part of one of their first ever scripted holiday movies. Well, I think it makes a lot of sense because Ben thinks of himself as well, he someday he's going to be Santa Claus. So it's super cool to be a part of HGTV's first scripted holiday film. I also feel that once we finish this. I think HGTV needs to make a holiday film about actors in LA flipping homes in LA. <laughs> I am so excited to be in one of the first scripted movies for HGTV. I didn't even know that until recently, so it's very exciting. So oh my God! <laughs> Do you know you're like the first person who's ever been able to actually scare me? Good job. Okay, I'm done. <laughs>